in this particular image? Were you able to identify the co-defendant, Cortland Henry? Yes. And where is he looking in that one photo? Can I stand up, Grandma? Uh, yes. You can let, me, um, let me see if I can get something to point with, Your Honor. So. It's on touch screen, right? This time. That's not, so. If you could point to Cortland Henry. Okay, so it's not working on that screen on that, so just if you keep your back. Okay. okay, do you see the individual identified as Jamal Dimmons in this picture? Subject right there. Okay. The other individuals that are in this photo, were you able to identify them? Yes. And who are they? This is Jamon Mitchell. He was in the email chain, um, sent through the YNW Melly booking Gmail account. This is Jaquan Burton, Q Shine, or uh, Perk, as saved on the phone. And this is Derek Dixon, uh, aka Gino, saved on the 9807 phone number. And the hand signs and symbols that are being shown, what are they indicative of? So, this hand sign right here, that's a big B for blood. This right here is G shine, same hand sign that Melly or Mr. Demons is throwing up. Same hand sign he puts on his music albums and commonly uses. It's a specific hand sign, just the G shine, to be gangster killer bloods. Well, this is a universal hand sign for Bloods. This is universal hand sign for Bloods. This, this is specific to gangster killer Bloods. Okay, so I'm gonna go and scroll down further on that same page, same 39 <coughs> see. Thank you. So going down here on December 12th of 2018, there's a message from, again, the Gino to the 9807 phone number. If you could read that message aloud. Are you a Ruru? I was thinking you should drop a few chains and give them to the gang. That'll show people who you connected with. It's not mandatory, just a thought. Okay. And the response? Not everybody, of course. Is there a like dues or tithing that's required as for membership in a criminal gang? Yeah, as described in the oath and many times throughout the Bible, it's not about the individual, it's about the collective. The mere mere fact that he wasn't even communicating with Gino and with his lineup enough, um, that was enough for them to say, you're not doing enough for us. And now, to step further, let's, you know, we need to be brought to these shows and you should buy us uh, some jewelry because oh. that jewelry is not cheap. Okay, so then the next message um, from December 12th is 
It says you're in the position to be a young Don. What is a young Don? Uh, higher up, uh, Captain. Okay. Is that one of the ranks? They didn't reference that name as a as in their Bible as what they call their ranks. So it's, it's, I think it's just like a, like a term related to the mafia, Don. Okay. And the response from the 9807 phone number is? Let's do it. Okay. Then Gino continues on in the next message on 12-12-2018, still on page 40. In that message, it's up there. Is there other terms and things that you see that would be indicative of G-Shine or Gangster Killer Bloods? Yes, so I'll read it and then I'll go through it. Okay. Uh, bet that, Ascari. But seriously, I want you to really think about the power you possess, little brother. I'm just here to show you how to use it. So the first thing is Gino is addressing the 9807 number as Ascari, which is rank. It's not like saying blood or homie or um, any of the other, or Herc or twin. He's specifically calling him Ascari. It would be like calling him general if he was in one of the first floor, second floor, third floor, fourth floor, fifth floor general spots, or Godfather, something to that effect. He's saying, Ascari, you are an Ascari. And we know that based off his email, where he has a document that says, you have now ascended to the position of Ascari. So this reaffirms that. And then Gino explains, I want you to think about the power you possess. And that power comes from, in my opinion from what I've read through all these messages, the power is money. Money is power in a game. And not only is money power, but fear and intimidation Objection. is power. Sustained. Okay, so going on. Right. If you're disregard the last comment, stricken. Moving on to the next page 42 at the very top. If you could read that message aloud. Once the family gets a real glimpse of how you rock with me, it's all access granted. Be like a young Nick Scarfo, Nicky Scarfo. Who is Nicky Scarfo? Uh, Philly mob boss. Okay. Very powerful mafia boss in Philadelphia. Okay. So then there's other messages, December 23rd, 2018, where Gino is asking for something. Can you read that one aloud, please? The things that I ask you to do don't even cost money. Shake my head. SMH. Okay. Um, with response, then December 23rd, there's a message about on at 8.18 a.m. If you could read that one. No more shows for you <laughs> and that N-word. Okay. Track. Track being the uh, his manager. Uh, Mr. Demons' manager. Okay. I'm putting bubble gum in his hair. Yin Yang twin looking ass. Okay. Um, the next request, if you could read that one aloud. The Godfather wants to know if we can be an R&B group. Is there anything based on your training and experience that you can say about that particular message? In these organizations, uh, higher ups usually call the shots, although the guys on the bottom of the totem pole might be doing their own thing, um, either, you know, whatever hustle they decide to choose. They have some autonomy, um, but at a certain point, if you get directions from your higher ups, you kind of have to start listening to them. Um, you wouldn't just be able to act reckless and do whatever you want, so you would get some, some kind of direction, especially if it's for the benefit of the organization and benefit of the game. Okay, moving on from page 43 on to 44. At 1226, the Rue, I need to skyline with you. What does that mean? Just need to, I need to talk to you, need to meet up with you. Okay. And then the next message, 44. The next message on page 44. I'm here to help you, but I refuse to not be helped back. It takes a seat out. In all actuality, you don't fuck with me or with the set. 
I'm beefing with N words in Florida, and I don't even know. Shake my head. Why are you even around? And if you can remind the ladies and gentlemen of the jury, what does it mean to be false flagging? False flagging is claiming something that you're not. So saying you're blood when you're not a blood, or saying you're blood and you are blood, and you're just not acting like a blood. Mm -hmm. Holding to your values or your oath as a blood. Okay, going to page 47 at the very bottom. What is being asked of the 9807 number at this point? Post me for my belated birthday, Herc. I'm only asking because I got a, I got hella hoes last time you posted me. He's uh, asking 9807 number to post him on social media um, because it got him a lot of females last time he did that. So he's clock chasing. Okay. And can you explain what clout chasing is? Trying to get popular, famous, get a lot of views, um, become famous using social media, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, uh, any platform, TikTok, Twitch. Um, these um, gang members are on all these platforms. Regular people are on all these platforms. Everyone's, like I said, the era of social media. Everyone's trying to make money on social media. And he's trying to um, get females. 